Offensively, the Dayton Flyers this year will have some experience at a number of positions. One of them that will not have a lot of experience, but still I think will be a very strong unit, will be our offensive line. Now the good thing is we have Tom Corcoran and Ben Esty anchoring that offensive line. Both of them are fifth year seniors, both of them good size, stayed here all summer and are ready to go this year. Garden Center, we have some great candidates in there. Chris Cortaposi, who we moved from tackle position to add some depth there at our guards. And Grant Georgia, who's been a backup the last couple of years under Bill Petriulo, but has always been ready to go and has actually played in some games. So up front there, we feel like we have some great uh, individuals that can help us. At the running back position, we feel very confident about Robert Washington and Connor Kaser. Two young men that played a lot last year, Connor till he was injured, uh, but a lot of yardage out of those two young men, especially Connor who set a freshman record with three consecutive 100 yard games. At the wide receiver position, again, good depth there with Ross Smith and Brandon Johnson on the outside. And then on the inside, we have Gary Hunter and Gabe Maces to run our slot positions. All very skilled receivers that can catch the ball and uh, Brandon Johnson can be a deep threat for us there. And then it all comes back to the quarterback and Will Bardo is returning for a senior year and in a good competition with Luke Johnson, a junior, who uh, two different players. Will is a very athletic, and throws the ball well. Uh, Luke probably a better passer than runner. But both young men are coming in proving that they should be the number one quarterback and uh, we're excited about uh, their performance this summer.